Good evening and welcome everyone. Sorry it's been so long. And yes, I'm back. But not with the usual videos that I posted three to four months ago. I'm here with Hogwarts. Hogwarts Legacy. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. So character is done. I did that off camera because obviously no one wants to see that. So let's let's go. Let's rock and roll. Oh, I'm here with my pal. He is in my party chat, but obviously you guys won't be able to hear. So if you hear me chatting, it's to him. So let's get going. The cut scene, I believe, is good for this, isn't it? Or the opening scene. Yeah, this character looks better. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me at the whole town Oh, who's this who's this lad? <laughs> Eleazar! George! <laughs> Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not I think speak. my character yeah. needs to work Eleazar. on her smiling. Of course. She needs to take some Why smiling classes when she gets to Hogsmeade. We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Looks a bit concerned, that lad. Spooky. Who's that guy? I think these guys have done a terrific um, job with the um, with this game in general, haven't they? Really. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'm looking forward to this game, and I'm looking forward to kind of getting into it. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and I'm not, and I'm not and a Harry Potter fan. Time, I'll be honest. Then, but I don't think you yes, need to be a Harry Potter fan to play this game. You? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary! It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? Mm. Goblin Rebellion. Watch out for those dudes. How great a they look gnarly. Is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And... It was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. 
wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you? Merlin's eat? what? We did. <laughs> I was literally just going to say, when is this guy going to use his spells? Are you alright? You're hurt. Oh, she is hurt. I'm on like Take 10 this. HP. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Now, I need to get used to these controls. Oh, can, oh, the haptics in my controller. I can feel her heartbeat. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir? <sighs> where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Porky. An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Okay, move. Yeah. Roll. No. Jump. No. Okay. I'll just keep on wandering around. How far did that bookie take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those roads. The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path. However faded it may be. Yeah, he's an eager beaver. So is she. Oh, I can run now. Mind your Roll. Step. Jump. Okay, jump. Got it. Square doesn't do anything at the minute. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Uh, who is to aim, aim your wand, I guess. Seems 
seems to have been lost to time. Oh, bit of glitchy, bit of glitchiness there, I see. Felianos. Oh, yeah. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the book key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, that's the path down below. This way. Um, I'm playing on the highest. Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful yeah. magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Well, I nearly landed on his head. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Okay, tap R2 to perform a basic task. Okay, use your camera. Okay. Some players prefer to select targets and move the other tile with the same stick by dis disabling camera, camera relative targeting in settings. Okay, well, I'll have a look, see how I get on with this. That's a bit rougher than I'd expected. Okay. I see, so if I'm looking at the item. Oh, hold on, I have a phone call coming in, chaps. One second. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I'm back. Well, let's go and follow Professor Fig. Professor Fig rolls. That comes to mind at the minute. Chesticle. 47 buckaroonies. We're close now. It's Professor just Fig, you, you, you were trying to lead me away from the loot. Give me... Give me Revelio. Oh, Repero. Repero! It's got a good bit of range on this, isn't it?
Oh yeah. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect yeah. they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Mm. Let's have a look over here. Oh. The minimap shows your surroundings with you as the purple triangle in the middle. Okay. Okay, so I have to go to the objective. Press and hold. Okay, okay. That's, that seems good. I know, obviously. Oh, investigate. I will investigate. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. Hmm. He interrupted me. Just practicing my wand work. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could <laughs> it be blocking? I'm only I'm only practicing my wand work, dude. What's this? Professor Fig. <laughs> Revelio. Someone have conjured that enchanted stone here. And how is there a room behind it? What? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow <coughs> on the hockey container. I've got to interact with magic. What in Merlin's name? Oh, wait, the goblin is the next thing. Where are we? I don't believe it. Wake up, goblin. Come on, hit him right in the head, look. Look, that's right on the top of his head. This dude up. Oh, Hello? investigate. The goblin banker. <clears throat> oh, he, nearly, he nearly took a conniption. He looks like a friendly goblin, though, this guy. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Mm, welcome, sir. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Mm? Your wife's pop key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. Yeah, my hat. I don't know whether I don't know whether I'm going to leave haptics on or can I turn them down. I might be able to just minimise them a bit. After you. Right. Okay. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart. If you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> they do, they do. The haptics do definitely make the game cooler. How many votes are there? Oh, what is that? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vote number 12. No, 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 no haptics. We're just beneath the main lobby. The vote you see now are the nearest. A 
private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only when we greet wealth or power or both could have yeah, arranged. I'm not gonna skip this, I wanna see this whole thing. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security Ooh. measure. Experience the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How do you know we got it? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. 400 years ago. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Maybe it's just been passed down through the generations of family. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. He doesn't look very um, accommodating. Very accommodating at all. Need to scour for collectibles. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one There's a collectible has right there, I would say. Until today. I am a loot master. A what? I better not get automatically cut scened in here. Thank you for your help. There's a chest there. Oh. Okay. Thank you, sir. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Mm, well, I think we should be looking so, for more of those I little chests. The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Boy. <laughs> Thank you, Mark. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay, steady your wand with the left stick and guide it along the symbol to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol's path. I suppose I have to complete the spell before the red line catches me, is that? Revelio. There! I saw something! Move a bit closer and try again. Okay, I'll move closer, dude. Revelio. A door? Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw in the Porky container. If what you can see reveals the way forward... Revelio, you haven't wiped your bum to bum today, Professor. Revelio! <laughs> you have skiddies.
Revelio Smelio. <laughs> Lumos. Oh, Lumos. Give me this Lumos. Is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I think Revelio has quite a good um, I can't say. Stay um close. outreach. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of green cards. Oh yeah? So you can get a wider cast with it to see more, I guess. I didn't claim my PlayStation codes yet. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on Ooh. the floor. I saw something. I was trying to light that torch with my wand power. Rebellion. <laughs> what happened? She's quite when strong, I this girl. The glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir, I'm fine. You seem to have Excuse caused me. the floor to change. That statue. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelia. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Come and stand over here, Professor. Pass, Lumos. Oh, Lumos. 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 I'll have a little bit of Lumos. Okay, you've acquired the wand light in charm Lumos. Which has automatically been slotted into your spell set. Lumos Cre Okay, yeah, okay. So, hold. Okay. I'll have to get used to Lumos. these. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Okay. Oh. Looks like we've got a bit of a, um... Protecto! Oh man, he's got to slam him! Protecto! Comprendo? You get quite a good generation of time to parry, do you? Stay close. I can't. I can't do the. You know what I'm trying to do. Oh, I can't do the crouch down. Professor, Professor Fig, Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Yeah. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Oh, chesticle. What did I get? Coinage. Oh, I can feel some haptics when I'm running on this surface. I don't think there's any other just the cause yeah I know they're leading me I guess they're leading me are they Rebellion. 
Oh. Lumos. More coinage. Okay, plus two chests. I think any kind of money in this game is. Uh, oh, that's where they're leading me. I think it could be. Glow again. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Wonder is our money glitch. I suppose I'm on my own this time. To line them up perfect, I believe. Just to do that to each one of them. Ooh. I guess I need to come around. Oh, okay. Here we go. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight. I need to align these statues. Oh. 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 Okay, hold during Protego to stun enemies and stupefy counterattack. Stunned enemies take extra damage. So I guess that just means while they're down on the ground, you can do extra damage to them when they're when they're recoiled. Oh, I didn't see that guy. I didn't... Oh, it's triangle to block. Oh. I'll, I'll get a ringed. Yeah. I guess I need to uh, get myself some health pots. I probably won't need them so much, will I?
Yeah. So when you see the power window, you press the uh, triangle button. I have, how do I check? Stop. Ah. Uh. Okay. Oh. Oh, uh, an Alexa. Pensive for viewing men memories. I okay. <clears throat> Follow my lead. Well, I should have that mountain dew. Oh, wash your face time. Is that Merlin? Merlin's beard? Is that Merlin's beard I see? All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Hmm. I thought he was going to stick that. I thought he was going to stick that wand in his eyeball. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Doris. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can...
can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. God, I was only no. doing his job, dude. Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. It'll be time to leave. My description can't be wrong, surely. That's the PlayStation that's automatically given that description. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Okay. Looks like we got out of there in one piece. Oh, good. We hadn't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? I was born ready, dude. Let's get this sorting ceremony sorted. to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. 
There were... complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. And that guy's a douche. All I've got to do is walk in, sit on the chair, put the hat on, sorted. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Um, hmm. I can't wait to start classes. I can't wait to explore. Well, let's do I can't wait to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. I wonder... Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm, what is it? Daring, curiosity, loyalty, ambition. Mm. Well, curiosity. Let's go with that. A desire to learn? I do enjoy a good puzzle. And I believe I have a ready mind. Mm. You're clever indeed. You have the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind, quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. Perhaps I do, dude. Perhaps I do. No. I'm going to be a Ravenclawist. You belong in Ravenclaw. A Raven Chlorist. No, because the, fir the first question I said I can't wait to explore, rather than I can't wait to start classes. Yeah, someone popped in chat and said my description says something about Tomb Raider, but I didn't put a description. And one more thing. I checked on my phone though. I didn't. The I can't see the description. On the Can you see it? Spring's final. This year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But no. Don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Maybe that guy's just trying to troll me. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I had five watching I'm at Professor one point. Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. This is what I'm interested in to see. The only reason why I picked Ravenclaw is because on one of the trailers, someone had said it's that you get to see the common room in there. this game. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. <coughs> This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. 
lived longer the ghost mm. or the poltergeist the ghost or a poltergeist hmm a non-being can never have been well done now go on in and get some sleep you have a big day ahead of you tomorrow i shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. It took nearly an hour to get here. It took about 50 minutes, I'd say. Because I think I streamed just after half eight. Okay. Oh, looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Okay, well let's Revelio the place, see what we got in my room. Is this my room? Where's my where's my roommates? Guess I'm late. Oh the mirror's a bit glitchy. Pop out here and see what's going off. Okay, well, okay, well, let's tell him to go up. Let's go down. Ooh. Rebellion. Anyone in the toilets? No one's in the toilets, dude. Can I pinch? Can I pinch some of my classmates' gear? But I, I can look. Man, no, they've got they got a chest in their room. I just, I just, I just stole their coinage. Did you did you go down and collect all this lovely loot? Oh, that's the toilets, I guess. Oh. Is this my room? Rebellion. How am I supposed to know what room number I'm in? The doors are all identical. That's just brilliant, Army. I mean, this should be interesting. Brilliant. You think you could Ah That is not how that Okay, introduce yourself to Amit Everett. And Samantha. Oh, okay. Then my room. Then my room is. Oh, a big chesticle. Level one lock. So I guess I need to learn a spell or find a lock pick. Just that 
to wait for the right moment. Okay, let's introduce myself to this dude. One moment. Watch this. Oh. Man, he's stink bombing everyone. <laughs> that wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. He better Could not be my roomie. Way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. He's a bit stenchy. I'm going to say I'm looking I'm forward to my to first here. day. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not Everett all the tricks Plopton. I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Take it easy, dude. Stop dung bombing people. Avelio. Must be different. Starting hot in the I'm not sure this is the right spot. Hmm, let's have an apple. Let's go and introduce myself. Oh, Samantha. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Great golden golden gobstones. gobstones. <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wigginwild Potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about Wigginwild Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Let's be a bit elusive. He did teach me a few things before term, but that's all I can tell you. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Mm. Do students grow their own ingredients? Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Hmm. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Dittany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. She's she is where I'm gonna be able to get my weed from. Alright. Deep breath. This guy looking at in broad daylight. It's kind of peeping Tom. Why hello? Would you like to take a look? Mm, yeah, I'll have a look. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. I find the stars fascinating. Yeah, I don't really. I've never been one for stargazing. I'm, I'm not much for memorizing constellations. 
Enough to worry about on the ground. Well, you should know that all fifth years must take astronomy. However, I think you will feel differently after one night up on the tower. A quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. Hmm. <laughs> They're talking about me. Right in the mush. Take one in the... Take one in... Take one in the jugular. Talking behind my back. Okay, meet Professor Weasley outside of the common room. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the Headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Ooh. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay. This way. Do I always walk around with my wand out, I wonder? You opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. <laughs> she hasn't put it away, look. She's, walking around. She's just wandering around with her wand out. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Well, what's this white dot on my screen? I press L2. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide Revelio. can provide? Okay, guide pages. This bust, created in the honour of the Ravenclaw House, resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. You've unlocked the field guide. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Um, okay, open. Well, I guess that's that one, is it? Okay, this is your wiz wizarding level. Um, XP earned from challenges. Yeah, I'm all about the XP. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Okay. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlocks. At each tier you complete, from appearance to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenge menu. Come back often to collect rewards that you've unlocked. Okay. Clever. 
isn't it? <laughs> Keep your eyes open for more opportunities for very well. Inside and outside of the castle. Oh, okay, so this is my eyeball. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Okay. Revenia. Ooh. We've got something here. Okay, we got something here. Okay, so crab. Rebellion. Okay, I'll follow Professor Weasley. I can come back to that. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Your blue field flames. guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Open map, okay. Okay, Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where the students and professors live. Um, and includes the house, common rooms and the Great Hall. Okay. Select region. Okay, what do I do here? I'll turn to map. The library annex. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames for you. Uh, use okay. Where to? Where does she? Central Hall. Well, what I might do, do, dude, is I might have a little break here and watch your screen for a and bit while I are. just get a little snack or something. Saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Yeah, I just, I just might, I might pause it here. You can get almost anywhere in the castle. Okay, oh, hold on. I'll finish. I'll finish her dialogue first. Something happening here. It's the heart of the heart. And then I'll Our stop King's my Cross stream. Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Um, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna thank her. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Um, my suspicions is that there was more to the story. There is, in fact, I'm afraid there isn't. I'm sorry, Professor, but 
I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm just glad you Skip on down, guys. One piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Okay. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Hmm. Okay, guys, well, I'm not going to interact with Professor Fig just yet. I wonder... Let's see. Do I need to do a save-out? Um, how do I do a save out settings? Uh, yeah, there we go. Save game. Um, empty save slot. Yes. Okay. Brilliant. Well, that's part one. I, I suppose a bit of a long intro, but definitely worth it. There's probably more to come, I guess. But look, leave it there for now. And I will be back.